Why hello there everyone and welcome back. I'm your host today Mr. Mobile and we've got a brand new hub. It is October guys and that means we're going to be getting some spooky stuff in Fortnite Creative and the first thing we're getting it looks like is a brand new spooky themed hub. Now straight off the bat as you can see there is a floating hub thing up there and that's because the map takes a very very long time to fully load in. You kind of got to run over and get everything loaded in which is upsetting because this map really really does look good but we have indeed got a little hub quest yes now we don't get any free stickers this time or anything like that it's just for fun now after guys we're going to go underneath the map in replay mode to see if there's anything hidden in the depth but anyway let's go ahead and check this out and i gotta say i do love the look of that cave over there so we're going to be checking that out so you might notice when you're running around that where is it Haha, uh -huh. there are these little things that says grab shovel, but it brings up the shovel seems to be broken. Look around for a better one. Okay, let's go over here. Check this here area out. Why not? I bet you there's this one here. Is this a working one? It looks like a, a dog dirt pickup shovel. That is also a broken shovel. Why don't we go on over here then to this area that we were in before. And what's over there? This gravestone? Gravestone? Another shovel. This one here seems to be better. Ah, you find the shovel. Make your way over to the gate next to the Molosseum to clear the path. I think that's how you see it. Is that Molosseum? I have no idea. But yeah, it says up there, clear the path. Shovel fine. Head back to the gate to clear the path. So, use shovel to remove rubble? Why, of course. Ta-da. No, I think they were meant to turn the explosives off there. But uh, that's fine. And then we go through the door. Wait, this wasn't here before. Wow. Whoops, I, I've done it and none of this was here. Oopsie, you completed the hub quest. Happy Halloween everyone, I don't celebrate it but sure. We hope you enjoyed the hub. Share us a screenshot of you completing the hub quest to them on Twitter. Yes guys, I made it on the list, everyone else. I did it, I did it, I got onto the list guys, yes! Yeah but it has this little daily gun game thing here when you get through. That would be kind of funny if um, that there appeared you know, here on up and coming, you know, because then you wouldn't need to do that to get it. But let's go ahead into replay, check it out, and we'll end it there. So this here quest could honestly take about a minute to complete because I went, oops, too far, too far. Because I did go back there and it said it took me three minutes to do it. Oops, I got rid of the light box. I'm going to have to go back for my thumbnail for that one. Let's zoom out a wee bit. Okay, there we go. First thing I want to check out is this amazing looking cave, but um, hello, cave, no cave, I think, I think I broke the map guys, I think I broke it, oh well, but this, this water is still working, how did they do that with the water, like, can I make it fog out like that, it works really, really well, oh is it, is that light bit, the fog stuff, yeah, it's on ripple, yeah, I see it now, I see it now. Okay, we then got a wee path going on up here. Oh, <laughs> I was about to say, there's floating props up here, but it's bats. Interesting that they used, like, the HUD message device in here. I don't know why you would have used it. Is it to make it look like there's glass? Because way back here, you it's like just hard to see. In here, oh, there's a chair. This is interesting. Why is there a chair up here? Hmm? I mean, there's no portal because it would have appeared. But that's very cool that there's a chair in there. So there is actually a wee bit of secretivity in these here buildings. I like the way they've done these hills too. Wow, those are done really well. I wonder how they've done that. Oh, there's a wee tiny house here. This looks like a mouse would fit in it. Well, almost any house a mouse could fit in. But, I mean, just a mouse, not a person. Oh, the bri was there not like a full bridge here? No, am I losing the plot? Another little house over here. Anything inside? Oh. Well, that would be kind of an awful door to have in your house. Wow, that is, not even a fly could fit in this house. Oh, boy. Kind of looks like Hello Neighbor houses when they first came. Anything under this? Why is that there? Why is there like a red light there? Interesting, interesting. Right, let's go ahead underneath the map, though, and see if there's anything hidden beneath the depth. There's triggers, obviously, for the shovel and stuff. But besides that, 
there's some squiggly things here. That must be when they were trying to make the model maybe or something. But it doesn't seem like there is any other things hidden in the map. We did find a secret little chair here. But besides that, that's everything guys. If you enjoyed this video, why don't you go ahead and leave a like. It tells YouTube that this is a good one and most likely is not a fake video. Anyway, I'm your host today, Mr. Mobile. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one. Hello.